Welcome to our channel Focus on Sharing Immigration Infos. We are volunteers who want to provide accurate, up-to-date, and easy-to-understand information on immigration to Canada. Our channel is not affiliated with any immigration agency, and we are not immigration agents, lawyers, or consultants. We only share information from official Canadian government sources, and we do not provide legal advice. We break down complex concepts and procedures into simple, digestible pieces to empower viewers with the knowledge they need to make informed decisions about their immigration journey. We provide informative videos and interviews with immigration experts. We encourage viewers to seek professional guidance from licensed immigration consultants or lawyers for their specific needs, as every individual's immigration situation is unique. Our goal is to provide valuable information and resources to those considering immigrating to Canada. Thank you for joining us on this journey. Welcome back to our YouTube channel, where we guide you through the process of obtaining Canadian permanent residency. In this video, we will discuss the second step, taking the language test. Language proficiency is an important aspect of the Canadian immigration process. To assess your language skills, you will need to take an approved language test. The most common language tests accepted for Canadian immigration are the International English Language Testing System IELTS, Test de Connaissance du Français TCF Canada, and the Canadian English Language Proficiency Index Program CELPIP. These tests evaluate your abilities in reading, writing, speaking, and listening. It's important to prepare well in advance to achieve the required scores. You can find study materials and practice tests on the official websites of IELTS, www.ielts.org, and CELPIP, www.celpip.ca. Depending on the immigration program you choose, there may be specific language score requirements. For example, the Federal Skilled Worker Program requires a minimum of 6.0 in each language ability for the IELTS General Training Test. It's crucial to familiarize yourself with the language requirements of your chosen immigration program and aim to achieve the necessary scores. If you don't meet the language requirements, you may consider improving your language skills or exploring other immigration options. Once you have successfully completed the language test and obtained the required scores, you can proceed to the next step in the process. In the next video, we will discuss step 3, getting your foreign credential assessed.